find interesting. Check this out. This is the, that's the Golden Gate Bridge. That's the gap, right? You see the higher clouds, that represents the cirrus clouds from the weather systems up north. But you can see that marine layer and see how it's tailing off into the bay. It's actually working its way into Berkeley at Berkeley Marina. I don't know if you can see it. If this is, you'll see a wisp of clouds. But the main takeaway here is you see the fog offshore too. See how it's a little deeper on the other side of the hills, the coastal hills, marine headlands. But that pinched down marine layer is the inversion, right? So when you see the atmosphere doing that, you know it's warming. That's high pressure, air sinking. Where I am right now, the temperature's 74 degrees and I'm up at maybe 1500 feet. The uh, temperature tomorrow, we're gonna see numbers that can make it into the 80s tomorrow in many places. So it's gonna be a pretty awesome couple days ahead. And then we do have some changes coming. It's an interesting fog formation too. You can tell so much. So that's over, that's this side of the airport. So that's Skyline Boulevard, Pacifica. And then you can see the airport down here and the fog trying to push in. Anyway, yeah, I don't usually go live, but I was, I, weather is so awesome in that, right? You can tell so much from that picture. So right away, if I didn't know from looking at the models, it was gonna be a very warm day tomorrow. I'd look at the fog and I go, God, that inversion looks like it's about 800 feet. 800 foot inversion, that, you know, that'll get you something. It'll also get you a spare of the air day. I don't know if they'll issue one for the next couple of days. And then changes do come. We're going to get ourselves into a cooler period, but not until like the 28th or 29th. Okay. See how that, we'll see how that worked. I don't know how that worked, if you could see that or not, but I just wanted to share it with you. Also, the thing I'm noticing too is tons of bugs. When it gets hot like this, I don't know if you can see those guys, but the bugs are just going at it. And so they're hatching, right? Their temperature hits a certain, they all hatch at different temperatures, but temperature gets to a certain part, this point for a lot of these insects, they start to go. Alrighty, I think that about covers it. All right, have a nice uh, Sunday. I'll see you back on the uh, Bill Martin weather, what do we call it? Bill Martin West Coast weather. But I'd love it if you'd subscribe too, if you can. Thanks. Thanks for, uh, I'd love your feedback on this kind of thing too. All right, take care.